In 2015 Spain produced 2.7 million cars which made it the eighth largest automobile producer country in the world and the second largest car manufacturer in Europe after Germany. The forecast as of 2016 was to produce a total of 2.8 million vehicles from which about 80% is for export. During the first half of 2016, with exports valued over €24,000 million Euros over that period, the automotive industry accounted for 18.9% of the total Spanish exports. In 2016, the automotive industry was generating 8.7% of Spain's gross domestic product, employing about 9% of workers in the manufacturing industry in all there are 13 factories located in Spain which are supported by a thriving local car components industry including rapidly growing Spanish multinationals such as Gestamp Automotion or Grupo Antolin the main manufacturers established in the country are Daimler AG manufacturing plant in Vitoria, Ford its plant located in Almasafes is Ford's biggest in Europe, Opel Figurulas, Nissan Barcelona, PSA Peugeot Citroën Vigo, Renault with plants in Palencia and other Spanish locations, Seat Martorell, Volkswagen Pamplona. From these production plants, as of 2016 the two biggest by volume are the ones of SEAT in Martorell and PSA in Vigo. Historical development Early Spanish manufacturers included a world-class brand like Hispano Suiza, originally founded as La Quadra in 1898, as well as smaller companies such as Elizald or Ricard. Foreign makers started to set up local subsidiaries in the 1920s, with Ford Motor Iberica opening its Cadiz premises in 1920 and General Motors Peninsula in Morlaga in 1927. By 1936, the industry had reached a significant volume, and was in continuous growth and modernization. The Spanish Civil War interrupted this development, and the decade of economic isolation that followed made it very difficult for it to resume. In the mid-1940s, a number of home-grown companies started to emerge, led by Anasa, a state-owned conglomerate built around the remains of Hispano Suiza, with brands like Pegaso or Sava. Things started to change for the Spanish car industry in the 1960s when an industrial policy was launched with measures which contributed the Spanish miracle. In the years from 1958 to 1972 the sector grew at a yearly compound rate of 21.7%. In 1946 there were 72,000 private cars in Spain, in 1966 there were 1 million. This growth rate had no equal in the world. The icon of the time was the Seat 600 car, produced by the Spanish company Seat. More than 794,000 of them were made between 1957 and 1973, and if at the beginning of this period it was the first car for many Spanish working class families, at its end it was the first second one for many more. Later on, in the 1980s the Spanish automotive flagship, Seat, was sold to the Volkswagen Group, but by then the manufacturing cluster had already been consolidated and other international manufacturers were already producing in Spain.
Topic: Spanish brands. Topic: Present Spanish brands. Topic: GTA Spano. Topic: Hurtan. Topic. IFR Aspid Topic Seat Seat is the sole active Spanish brand with a mass production potential and capability of developing its own models in house. Today it operates as a subsidiary of the Volkswagen Group, formed in 1950 by the Instituto Nacional de Industria and six Spanish banks with fiat assistance, under a name that stands for Sociedad Española de Automóviles de Turismo Spanish Saloon, Sedan Car Company. In 1953 the company produced their first model, the Seat 1400. This 44-horsepower four-door saloon car had a top speed of 75 miles per hour when production ceased in 1964 over 98,000 had been made. Models produced licensed by Fiat in the 1960s include the 600, 850, 1500 and 124. 815,319 of the 800 models were made between 1964 and 1967. Seat produced its one millionth car in 1968. By 2003 this figure had risen to more than 14 million. During the 1970s Seat produced the 67 horsepower 50 kilowatts 1200 model 1975 to 1980 and over 1.5 million 131 models 1974 to 1984. The Seat 1200 Sport was a two-door coupé produced by Seat from 1975 to 1979. The car was known as the Bocanegra because of the shape of its always black plastic nose panel, which embraced the front grille and the headlights and incorporated, by 1970s standards, a prominent front bumper. Boca Negra means black mouth in Spanish. Other models produced at this time include the 127, 128, 132, 133, and the Ritmo. Fiat's assistance ended in 1981 and was replaced by a cooperation agreement with the Volkswagen Group in 1982. Up to 1981 most seat cars resembled Fiat models. The 1982 Ronda model was the first car produced by seat without assistance from Fiat. Seat became a subsidiary of the Volkswagen Group in 1986. Other cars produced during the 1980s include the Führer (1981–86), Marbella (1986–98), Morlaga (1985–92), and Ibiza. The Marbella was a re-badged Fiat Panda, while the Giugiaro styled Ibiza launched in 1984 was the company's first new product after the split from Fiat. 
The Malaga was the saloon version of the Ibiza, but the Ibiza was far more popular. Models produced between 1990 and 2007 include the Arosa, Leon, Cordoba, Toledo, Alhambra and the Altea. In 2008 the company introduced the 1.4-liter, 170 horsepower, 127 kilowatts Bocanegra fourth generation Ibiza concept car. The Ibiza was in its fourth generation by 2008. The Toledo, launched in 1991, was SEAT's first large family car since it split from Fiat. The Cordoba, which ran between 1993 and 2008, was the saloon version of the second and third generation Ibiza hatchbacks, and was slightly more popular than the earlier Malaga. The Alhambra was SEAT's first MPV, launched in 1996 and based on the Volkswagen Charan and Ford Galaxy. The Leon, launched in 1999, was a small family hatchback aimed at the likes of the Ford Focus and Opel Astra. SEAT's replacement for the long-running Marbella was the Cita Rosa, launched in 1997, it formed the basis of the Volkswagen Lupo which was launched over a year later. 2009 models include the Leon MK2, Cordoba MK2, Toledo MK3, Alhambra MK1, Ibiza MK4 and Altea and the new flagship sedan model Exeo. The Exeo being derived from the Audi A4, shares the same fundamental powertrain layout and platform. Until the mid-1980s, seat cars were rarely seen outside Spain, but have since become popular in many export markets, including Britain, where sales began in the autumn of 1985. Just under 6,000 seats were sold in Britain in 1986, the company's first full year of trading there, exceeding 10,000 sales in 1988 and exceeding 20,000 a year by 2000, peaking at more than 45,000 in 2013. Topic: Sunred. Topic: Tauro Sport Auto. Topic: Tramontana. Topic: Historic Spanish brands. Topic: Abadal. Francisco Abadal, who used to work for Hispano Suiza, produced two luxury models between 1912 and 1923. They were fitted with either a 3,104 cc four-cylinder engine or a 4,521 cc six-cylinder engine. From about 1917 Buick engines were fitted and these cars were called Abadal Buicks. Approximately 170 Imperia Abadals were built in Belgium, including a 2,992 cc sports model. Alfie <laughs> <laughs> The Althi Car Company, which was formed in 1965, was the result of a collaboration agreement between Nueva Montana Cuajano and the British Motor Corporation. 
The company produced the following models: Alfi Mini 1968 to 1975, Alfi Mini Cooper 1973 to 1975, Morris 1100 1300 1966 to 1972, Austin Victoria 1972 to 1975, and the Austin Deluxe 1974-1975. In 1976 the company was purchased by the Sayat Car Company. Barreros The company was founded in 1954 as Barreros Diesel SA and initially it produced diesel engines. In 1963 a licensing agreement was reached with Chrysler to build the Dodge Dart in Spain. Between 1965 and 1977 a total of 17,589 Barreros darts were produced. These were based on the Dodge Dart GL, the Dodge Dart GT Sporty version and the Dodge 3700 GT using the body of the Argentinian Dodge Polara, Coronado. A diesel version called the Barreros Diesel was also produced. In 1969 Chrysler Europe took over the company. From the mid-1970s Barreros started manufacturing the Chrysler 180 and later the Simca 1307 called the Chrysler 150 in Spain and the Simca Horizon. In 1978, PSA Peugeot Citroën purchased Chrysler Europe and former models were renamed, the Chrysler 150 becoming the Talbot 150. Barreros later produced the Talbot Solara and Talbot Samba. Biscuta <inaudible> <inaudible> In the late 1940s Gabriel Voisin French, designed a small car called the Biscuta. The license to build the vehicle was obtained by Autonational SA. The first Biscuta car was launched in Spain in 1953 and was called the Series 100 or the Zapatia Little Shoe. The original models did not have doors, windows or a reverse gear. It was powered by a one-cylinder, 197cc, 2-stroke 9 horsepower engine which supplied power only to the right front wheel. The Biscuta car was produced for about 10 years. Topic <inaudible> Elizald. In 1909, Arturo Elizald Rouvier started a company was called Sociedad Mercantil J M Valle y C I A to manufacture car parts. A prototype called the Tipo 11 was launched in mid 1914. In 1915, King Alfonso XIII owned a 20 CV Biada Elizald Cabriolet Tipo 20. A 25 CV sports version of the Tipo 20 was produced in 1919 as the Reign Victoria name of the Queen Consorts. It is believed to be the first Spanish car to feature four-wheel brakes. In 1920 the company started production of the four-cylinder, 3817cc, Model 29. Variants of this model were built until 1927. 
production of the 8143 cc straight 8 model, known as the Tipo 48, also began in 1920. The car had a built-in tire pump which could also be used as a vacuum cleaner. A 5,181 cc straight-8 Grand Sport version of the Tipo 48 model, capable of 100 miles per hour (160 kilometers per hour), was also produced. Production of Elizald cars ceased in 1928. Topic. ENASA ENASA sort of Empresa Nacional de Autocamiones SA was a Spanish truck manufacturing company, incorporated in 1946 having bought the automotive assets of the Spanish arm of Hispano Suiza. It produced trucks, buses, sport cars, and military armored vehicles under the Pegaso brand and, for a short while, Sava brands. Pegaso built about a hundred high end Z102 sports cars in the 1950s. The cars were in many ways advanced for the time, as they had all-wheel independent suspension, a five-speed gearbox, very powerful supercharged engines, and were offered with the choice of Touring, Sautchik, Serra or Anasa's own luxury bodies. Anasa belonged to the state-owned INI Industrial Holding. In 1990 ANASA was sold to Fiat SP.A. Ivco. Ucourt The Eugenio Cortez S.A. company manufactured cars from 1945 to 1951, or 1953, the first Ucourt model, which was based on a pre-World War II Germany Dampfkraft Wagen DKW design, was fitted with 764cc twin-cylinder two-stroke engine. Four-door sedan and a three-door estate versions were available. In 1950 the company started production of its final model, the two-stroke 1034cc Victoria. By the time the company ceased car production in 1951-1953, about 1,500 Ucourt cars including taxis had been built. Topic: Hispano Suiza. In 1898, Emilio de la Quadra started a company in Barcelona called La Quadra to produce electric cars. Four years later, it was acquired by J. Castro. He changed the name to Fabrica Hispano Suiza de Automobiles, Spanish Swiss Car Factory. By the end of 1903, this company went bankrupt, re-emerging in 1904 as La Hispano Suiza Fabrica de Automobiles. In 1906 Hispano Suiza produced two models of 3.8 and 7.4 litres. Between 1907 and 1914 the company mass produced a range of cars, plus a number of hand-built racing models, including the Type A 1907, Type 15 1910, and the four-cylinder 3,620cc 65 hp Alphonse XIII 
In 1911 a factory called Hispano France was established just outside Paris, moving to another location in 1914, when they took the name Hispano Suiza. The stalk statuette fitted on top of each car's radiator was based on the squadron emblem painted on the side of the aircraft used by a World War I French ace, who owned a Hispano Suiza car. The Hispano Suiza H6 range was introduced in 1919. It was mainly built at the Paris factory. A few model built in Spain were called the T-41. About 2,350 of these ultra-luxury models were made up to 1933, the 6,597cc H6B and H6C between 1924 and 1927 about 50 H6Bs were built under license by Skoda of Czechoslovakia. The H6 was one of the first cars to be fitted with power-assisted brakes and originally came with a 6.5-litre engine. An 8-litre engine was fitted to the H6C model. In 1923 the French part of Hispano Suiza became known as the Société Française Hispano Suiza. The 8-litre T56 model was produced from 1928, plus a 3,750cc T49 model. Other models produced in Spain the 1920s include the 4.7-liter T34.7 (1914–24) and the 3,089cc T16 (1921–24). In 1930, Hispano Suiza took over Ballet, the French car manufacturer. The six-cylinder 4580cc junior model was produced from about 1930 to 1934. It was replaced by the 5.1-liter 120 horsepower 89 kilowatts K6 1934 to 37. The 9,425cc Type 68, which was produced in 1931, later evolved into an 11,310cc version. A six-cylinder version, the K6, succeeded the Junior in 1934. During the 1930s the company produced a range of luxury cars, including the 4.5-litre 95 horsepower 71 kilowatts HS26 1932, the 9.4-litre 210 horsepower 160 kilowatts and 11.3-litre 260 horsepower 190 kilowatts J. 12 model 1932 to 38 the last model produced by the company in Spain was the T60RL the car was produced from 1934 to about 1943 after the Second World War, Hispano Suiza France was primarily an aerospace firm. From 1955, their attention turned increasingly to jet engine manufacturing, and in 1968, they became a division of SNECMA. In 1999, they moved their turbine engines operations to a new factory in Bezon, outside of Paris, using the original factories for power transmissions and accessory systems for jet engines. In 2005, SNECMA merged with Sagem to form Safran. 
In Spain the Hispano Suiza company sold in 1946 their automotive assets to Empresa Nacional de Autocamiones S.A. a NASA, a Spanish vehicle manufacturing company. It has become Pegaso brand. Capi. Automobiles Y Autoscooter Capi produced cars from 1950 to 1955. The first model was a three-wheeled two-door car that was powered by a 125cc single-cylinder two-stroke engine. Other models include the Chaki, a three-wheeler with single wheel at the rear, the Platio Volante, a four-wheel coupé and the M190 with miniature Mercedes 190 body. <laughs> Bus manufacturing Spain has a large number of small, independent coachbuilders that cater mainly to the domestic market, but are also exported to the rest of Europe. Contrary to the large European bus manufacturers, who build their buses on an integral chassis, most Spanish manufacturers build a bodywork on a chassis supplied by a third party. As of December 2017, active coach builders include IITS, Bulis, Castrosua, Ferki, Indca, Irazar, Nodjabus, Obradors, Sunsundagui, UNVI Topic: Multinational subsidiaries Many foreign car and truck makers, like Volkswagen, Nissan, Daimler AG, Ford, Renault, Opel, PSA Peugeot, Citroën, Fiat Chrysler Automobiles Iveco etc. as well as suppliers have facilities and plants in Spain today developing and producing vehicles and components, not only for the needs of the internal market but also for exportation purposes, with the contribution of the automobile industry in 2008 rising up to the second place with with 17,6% out of the country's total exports. Ford opened a factory at Valencia in 1976 to build its new European supermini, the Fiesta, which is still being built there 40 years and several incarnations later, although it has also been built in Britain and Germany. The Escort and Orion were also built there in the 1980s and 1990s, as was the car from 1996 until 2008, when production of its successor was switched to the Fiat factory in Poland. The Escort's successor, the Focus was produced at the Valencia plant from 1998 until 2011, since when all European production of the third-generation Focus has been concentrated in Germany. The C-Max version of the third-generation Focus, however, was built there from 2010 until 2014. The factory also hosted production of a Mazda model, the Mazda 2, from 2002 to 2007, as part of Ford's venture with the Japanese carmaker. Nissan has been building cars in Spain at its Barcelona factory since 1983. The first model to be produced there was the Patrol four-wheel drive. 
It current builds several model ranges for the passenger car and commercial vehicle markets, the most recent addition being the Pulsar family hatchback in 2014. Renault set up a production facility at Via de Lid in 1951, producing some of its French-made products for the Spanish market. The Spanish production of some Renault models originally took place under the FASA Renault banner, and from 1974 to 1984 the company actually built its own saloon version of the hugely successful Renault 5 hatchback, which was known as the Renault 7, and was only built at the Valladolid plant. Nearly 160,000 R7s were sold, most of them on the Spanish market. The Spanish operations were rebranded Renault España from 2000. General Motors Europe opened a new factory at Zaragoza in 1982, for production of its new Corsa Supermini, which was imported to the United Kingdom as the Vauxhall Nova. Production of the Opel Cadet, Vauxhall Astra also commenced at Zaragoza in 1986. The Mariva was built there between its launch in 2003–2017. Volkswagen has concentrated production of its Polo Supermini at SEAT's Barcelona plant since it bought the company in 1986. All versions of the seat Ibiza produced since 1993 have featured the same floor pan and engines as the Volkswagen Polo of that generation. Topic: See also Economy of Spain AFA automobile a 1943 car